All right. Well, if you uh, have a book lover on your shopping list, uh, you get local uh, bookstores that you can hook you up. And Hulisa is here with all the details on how you can do that. Yes, we are continuing our shop local tour here. This morning we are in Folsom. Last hour we were at Hanley's. This hour we are helping you out. I'm trying to find fun new different stores. We're at Ruby's in Folsom. Good morning to you, Stacy. Hi, good morning. How are you? We are doing fantastic. We saw you when you first opened and you know, we love seeing your face, but I know you have, you know, kind of the star of the store is really Ruby. I Ruby. do. Ruby, yes. Ruby. Hi, Ruby. <laughs> she wonders why the door is closed. She's like, why? She says no one can come in if the door I is closed. I know, I know. All yeah. right, we won't keep it closed for too long. So let's talk a little bit. I, I know you sent me an email saying that the shopping has already begun, which we love to hear. So what kinds of things can people yes. find, right? For every, for stocking stuffer, um, the kiddos, you know, the, the, the person who's got every book. What kinds of things should we look for in your store? Yeah, yeah. We have um, something for everyone. We've got craft kits and oh. candles and books about how to make these crafts. We've got all the dog, fun dog stuff, of course, for dog lovers. Oh my and um, as you mentioned, we have books for everyone. We have over 12,000 titles. Oh my goodness. And uh, last time we did a walk through the store. Yeah. But Wait, um, what I was really excited second? to tell you guys about. Oh, can we yeah. go back? I want to see this bone thing. Is that a basket? Oh. Yeah, oh, the, the basket is just the decoration, oh, and then I've got so different cute. dog toys in here for sale. <laughs> yeah, These sorry, ones. slightly yeah. distracted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I digress. <laughs> so, yeah. And then uh, what I'm really excited to show you guys today is all of the products and books that we carry by local authors and local oh, artisans. Yes. Okay. So let's see. Um, I kind of put them in a table here so I wouldn't forget anybody. Uh -huh. um, but we have tons of books here that we have in from um, local, several Folsom authors yes. um, and other surrounding area. Um, you guys recognize Brian Wallace's book. He's um, promoted us with you guys before. Would he be related then, to a um, Lori Wallace? Jen Sweeney. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Jen Sweeney has a new book out called The Wish. Uh -huh. um, jo uh, Joanna Rowland has several books. She lives here in town. Um, Shannon Didamore and Stephanie Garber both have um, trilogies out. Oh my gosh, and that's um, fantastic. Lisa Schmidt has Ollie Oxley. That I don't great. think people realize how many local authors we have. I think you're right. And you know what? This yeah. mommy needs um, some coffee right there. We are actually going to yes. chat with her. Yes in the next, um, oh no, in this hour, in the eight o'clock hour. We're gonna chat with her oh, coming up with Rachel. Yes, yeah, so I'm so glad that you have that book because that just came out as well. I love that you are a small it, local business supporting other local authors, I love that. Definitely, yeah, and um, Rachel's book is so much fun. We also have um, Dan um, Winkleman is a gentleman that lives here in Folsom. He was a ranger for decades, and he um, put together this book of his story of kayaking on Lake Natoma. I love that. Some well, other Stacey, things that thank yeah. you so much. I love this. I know you've got lots happening for Small Business Saturday. We're hoping everybody will come by and we say do. hi with their mask and socially distant, of course. Um, but it's such a such a of great course, way yes. to, to support local and and just find some new things. Obviously, they have more than just books there too. So, Stacy, thank you so much great yes. to see you again Thank we've got you. all good her information you have a good day you too well all her information if you would like to come by and say bye we've got that linked up to our website goodaysacramento.com back over to you